Okay, so I've just made this document, and I am going to save it as a template. So you would do a file save as, browse. Uh, now, I'm going to put it into my junk, just so take note of that. And then this is going to be my personal template. And I'm going to change this Word document to a Word template. And as soon as I do that, you can see that it redirects my document into, it is taking it into my M drive, even though it doesn't look like that. It's taking it into my M drive into a folder called Custom Office Templates. And it's a good idea to have them there. So I will save that, and it will save that as a uh, dot uh, dotx file. So I'm going to close this file and I want you to notice that if I if I navigate to my M drive and I come into my custom office templates there's the personal template there Notice everything in this folder is a template. Uh, I don't have my extensions turned on right now. I have to think about where my show, oh, file name extensions. So just to show you, there's the .x. Now if I open this template from a file explorer window, also called a My Computer window, if I open it from a My Computer window, that is going to open it as a document one so that my template will always stay pristine. I can send a little letter here and save it and then close it. And when I want to uh, write another note to someone else, I can double click in a My Computer or File Explorer window and it will open as a document. Now, if I want to actually close this one. If I want to edit my template, if I had a mistake in it and I needed to open it as the .x file, I have to only do it this way. File, open. I have to use the open command and, and there it is there. And notice this time when I open it, it opens it as a .x and I can now edit this because I had a mistake. I can resave it as the dot X and I will close it now. Notice I'm 34 Street and if I open a file manager window here and I reopen this personal template, you can see that it has the 34 and is document 3. So it keeps your template, the .x file, pristine and unfinished and allows you to open it and create whatever you want and save it as a doc file.